Okay, so I am reviewing it's the Saguji Sink Drying Rack. Um, it is supposed to be for your counter and your sink. So as you can tell, it's being used on my counter. I originally bought it hoping it could sit inside my sink, but I'll show you the issue I had with it. Um, but, so I just finished washing these. I'm going to transfer them to a towel for now, just so you can see a couple things. Let's see. Sorry. Okay. So, uh, I did the correct measurements and everything, but when I did this, as you can see, because my, well, there you go. I measured it and everything, but because my sink corners are like super rounded, it just won't fit in the sink, even though I did the measurements correct. So that's why it's going on my counter. Um, as you can see, this is what it kind of looks like. It does have a little drain. See right here, it's got a little drain. So I just tip it out when water comes out. Um, sorry, doing this on my own. Um, it cleans really well. Like after I use it, I just dry it really quick so it doesn't water stain. Is that? Um, there we go. This is removable. Like you can put it on any side you want. When we first got it. Um, I had it going this way and it kind of took up most of my spot because this little guy underneath was pointed in this direction. And I just assumed I had to have it like that, but when I realized it pops off, you just pop it into place and then you can turn it whatever direction that you want it. And because it's just so light and easy, if I have, if I'm having people over and I don't want it to sit on my sink, I can easily just put it underneath my sink for the time being. But for every day, we usually just leave this out on the counter and it looks nice-ish for drying racks on your counter. Um, I think too much bigger would have taken up a lot of space. So I think the size works for saying